great element within Smart Notebook is what's called the screen shade. The screen shade is the equivalent of putting the piece of paper on the overhead projector that teachers used to use in the classroom before things went digital. This was where they would put the piece of paper on and they would slowly pull it down to reveal information underneath. That way they can conceal what they don't need the students to see at the moment so they can teach about a specific piece of information and have that app on the screen at that very moment. And as they needed to, they could simply pull down on the paper to reveal information. Screen shade, as you see, works the same way. I revealed this first piece of information. I'm done talking about it. I'm going to continue pulling down to reveal the next piece. And, I, and so on and so forth, whatever is on the page. So the screen shade is a nice little tool that allows you to pull it up and down and hide or reveal as you need. So to show you how this works, it's a very simple function. I've got my page of information already typed up. I'm going to simply come in and I'm going to click on this Show Hide Screen Shade button and it's going to turn it on. Now perhaps when I get to this page, I don't want the whole page covered up. I already want a small piece of information visible. So I can actually pull this down and say, I want it right here. When I save the file, I save it just like this and it's already ready. So the next time I open it up, the screen shade's already in place right there on that page. Now, one little quick tip with this, if you don't like the color gray, simply click on the screen shade and it will change colors. And you can choose from a variety of different colors that are built right into it. One last thing about the screen shade is that the screen shade also can be applied to a table. So I've got a table here and I'm going to select my table. And when I select my table, there's a little drop down on the side. It's, you know, when I click on this drop down, it's got what's called add table shade. I could use the screen shade button as well, but I'm going to do a table shade. When I do that, it covers up each individual cell on the table. And then I can click on cells to reveal the information underneath. In this particular case, I want the years to be visible to all the students, but then I want to reveal one piece of information at a time. So I click on it, it reveals that information, I talk about it, and then I move to the next piece of information. So it operates like the screen shade, but a little bit differently because it's applied to each individual cell and you just click on it to reveal.